Hey there, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can add the calories burned as a data field on your Garmin Instinct watch face. Now I'm using the Garmin Instinct first generation solar. It shouldn't matter which version Garmin Instinct you've got. This video should work the same for everybody. So your Garmin Instinct has various watch faces you can choose and then you've got various data elements you can choose. For example, I'm showing my status icons, I'm showing the barometric pressure, the sunrise and sunset, but one of the things you can show is your active calories, and I'm going to show you how to add that here. So it's pretty simple. It's the same as any other data field. First thing you're going to do is you're going to press and hold the menu button, and then you're going to press GPS to select the watch face. You can choose your current watch face, or you can move up or down to choose a different watch face. So I'm just going to choose this one, for example. Once you've got the watch face you want, you're going to press GPS to choose it, and then you're going to arrow down to customize in order to change the data fields on that given watch face. So the calories burned is one that's actually available in most of the data fields. You'll notice that my first data field is blinking up here in the right corner. This is going to be the data field that contains the most values and the most information in most of the screens. We're going to use the up or down button and we're going to basically cycle through until we see a value that looks like that. It's basically a flame or something burning. That's your active calories that are burned for that given day. Now in order to see this, you have to have activity tracking on. I'm going to go ahead and press GPS to confirm it in that data element, and then it'll take me to my next data, on the data element on the screen. Now, you'll notice as I go through here, I can also put it in this data element. Garmin doesn't restrict the number of data elements you can put a specific value in. Now, you probably wouldn't want it in both of those values, but you can put it in as many places as you can find it. If you don't want it there, let's say you want to put it down here at the bottom, you can simply move to the bottom place it there. You can always go back by pressing the back button to move up to a previous value and then change it to something else. But that's the icon you're looking for for calories burned. It'll reset every day. You can still see the history information in your Garmin Connect account. You can also see history information in the widget, but for the given watch face, the only thing you can see are the calories burned for that given day. Once you press GPS a few times, you get all the way through till you see the check mark. You've successfully added the calories as a data field on your Garmin Instinct watch. I hope the video helps.